Hello, grade four. How are you today? Can you guess here our lesson today about what? We have addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, and brackets. Our lesson today here is called order of operations. Which comes first? Here we have four operations. Addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. But sometimes you may have uh, two operations in one question. What are you going to do? What if you have three operations or four operations? Here we have orders and we have to follow. Can you guess here the question or the answer for this question? Six minus two divided by two. We have two ways to solve. Subtraction first, then division. Or division after that, subtraction. What do you think here? We have five and two. What do you think? Five or two? The order of operations here tell us the order. First here, you have to perform operation inside the parentheses. After that, multiplication and division from left to right. And finally, addition and subtraction. And we have this sentence. This sentence is going to help you to remember. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Here P refers to parentheses or brackets, M multiplication, D division, A addition, S subtraction. So according to PEMDAS acronym or the sentence, please excuse my dear Aunt Sally, five is the correct answer and two is the wrong answer. Now, let's uh, try some problems. Please, I want all of you to bring notebooks and pen just to practice. And uh, please remember, practice makes perfect. The first question here. Six, we have brackets. Nine plus one plus 36. First step here, you have to rid of the brackets. You have to solve inside the bracket. So, nine plus one equals 10 and again rewrite the question. Now we have three times 10 plus 36. After that, we have multiplication and addition. Multiplication first, so three times 10, 30 plus 36, the final result 66. From now, please try to mark yourself. One minute to think, after that, check your answer. Four plus five times Bracket, six minus two. You have to think here like mathematician. We have order, which is called here, the word is called again, PEMDAS acronym, P, parentheses, and ignore here E. E means exponent. Uh, in grade five or six, you are going to study this uh, word. After that, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Now we have addition, multiplication, and the bracket. So the first step, Solve inside the bracket, six minus two equals four. Now we have four plus five times four. Multiplication first, five times four, 20. Now four plus 20, 24. Did you get the correct answer? If you get, please put one mark here. The second question, 21 plus 100 divided by 10. Addition and division. Division first, of course. So 100 divided by 10 equals 10. Now 21 plus 10 equals 31. Again, please check yourself. 64 divided by, we have inside the bracket two operation, multiplication and subtraction. Again, according to the order, multiplication first. So nine times three equals 27 minus 19. Solve it please again inside the bracket. 27 minus 19, eight. After that, 64 divided by eight equals eight. Now we have a story problem. How can you solve any story problem? You have to read the story problem more than one time till you understand the problem. So let's read it. Muhammad ran eight kilometers on Saturday and twice, what is the meaning of twice here? You have to double times two. That amount on Sunday. He ran six kilometers less 
than here on Monday than he did on Sunday. How many kilometers did he run on Monday? How can you solve here? This is called the multi-step problem. You have to solve in two here steps. First of all, how can I solve? Write eight times two because of twice. After that, less than refers to subtraction. Now we have the operation eight times two minus six. According to BIMDAS acronym, multiplication first. So eight times two, 16 minus six. So 10 kilometers. Now we have the learning moments. I have learned today acronym called BIMDAS. B refers to parentheses or brackets. You have to solve inside the brackets first. After that, we have multiplication and division. Of course, from left to right. Finally, addition and subtraction from left to right. Now, have fun doing uh, the order of operations. That's all we have for today. Thanks a lot.